Hello everybody, it's Christine. It's time for a scrap timber process video. This is the 24th video. I'm actually recording this early, obviously, so I have to kind of check my calendar. And today's prompt is stars. So I got into my counterfeit kit, not this. I got in my counterfeit kit because I saw this piece of paper and I was like, oh, that's really cool. Um, and then I've got, the counterfeit kit had like, if you go back to the beginning of the month, there's like a, a reveal or whatever. And it had like, photo, you know, camera type stuff and some butterflies and stuff. I may still get it. I have my little envelope here. I may still get in my butterflies. I don't know yet because I kind of pulled out this photo. This was my daughter's college graduation. And I thought, you know, I got the blue and the, this kind of goes with this set of papers here is what I kind of thought to myself. So I may frame this out. This is what I'm thinking. I think I'm going to fussy cut this and use it as like a stripe on the side. I also have this really neat, it's not a sticker. What is it? Or maybe it is. No. Is that a sticker? I need to look at this, you guys. I don't know if this is a sticker or if it's just, if it's just shiny. What is this, y'all? Oh, it is a sticker. Oh, did not know that. Did not know that. Okay. Anyways, honestly, this has nothing to do with college graduation per se. It's just a bunch of photos on this photo thing. I wish to God I'd known that was a sticker all this time. I thought that was not a sticker. <laughs> so goofy. Because I pulled out my stapler. I thought I was going to staple that to that paper. Okay. And then I also have some little um, photo strip thingies. I have little viewfinder thingies. I also have like some black and white wordy bits. And then as you saw, I have these little acrylic stars here. I haven't a clue what my design is quite yet. I don't know what other papers I might pull out of here, if any. I want to keep it a little bit, uh, focus on these colors here. And so I don't know. I don't know. This, this could work because that blue works good there. That might work. We'll see. I'll set that aside. Or maybe this even. This is cool. Uh, that has that little rough thing. I won't do that. All right, anyway, I do need to figure out my design because I don't know yet. Other than I want to fussy cut those, I will probably mat this on maybe white cardstock. Where's my white cardstock? And maybe, oops, I'm dropping the markers. And maybe black cardstock. Um, maybe. Maybe, maybe, because I have to, I want to put this, I really do want to use this. Um, I think. I have to think on these ones. So, let me trim down some stuff here, and I'll be back on in just a moment. Okay, I have trimmed down my star paper and to mm, 11 and a half, I guess is what it is. I think that's right. And I'm laying that on top of my little stripes here, and I'm going to use my finger, and I'll just go around the edges. And I have already fussy cut my cameras over there. And the sad part, <laughs> I actually really like it, and I think it adds something, but at the same time, I almost cover quite a bit of it up, but you'll see in just a minute. I love this, though. I think this is kind of neat. When I go to glue it down, though, I tear one of them. I'm kind of mad at myself. <laughs> I was like, oh, shoot, I tore it. Um, but I'll put that down, and I'm kind of debating on this, the design here. I do want this vertical element, and I have this film roll-looking stuff. And you guys, you heard me during, I was kind of talking about what I was going to do. I had no idea that was the sticker. Like, I feel like such an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'll use that in just a second. Um, I got my little paper here. I'm going to cut basically a little horizontal block. And then I'm going to use the blue floral piece there and make a little vertical strip. And then the back side of that is like a little, I don't know, tone on tone, like real tiny little floral. And I'll use that as well. I'm going to kind of fast around with this because I kind of want it to have, I'm not 100% sure the design quite yet. I kind of have a sense of, obviously I have that vertical element a photo block, and then I want to have some little spots to hold something else. Or I, I know I'm going to put stars or something, So, I, but I don't know yet 100%. So you'll see me kind of think about stuff. <laughs> I think you can tell if I'm thinking about it. I don't know. We'll see. So I'm going to put this there, and then I have that little piece there on the right-hand side that I just trimmed off of that. And I think, oh, that can go right here. And so I'll try that out right there. And that's going to be kind of where that goes. Um, obviously, nothing's glued down yet. I'm going to start pulling out my acrylic stars, I think, in just a second and organize that. Let me see here. Yes, I have quite a few, actually. I have three, four, five, six, seven, eight, I guess. Um, so I was kind of proud. I used every one of these. I might not should have because I do like them. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I got eight. 
and the title is also an acrylic title. I love acrylic. I haven't really had too much of it, and I was actually looking the other day. I'm trying to decide if I want to join um, a little acrylic subscription box, you guys. I just don't know, because I sometimes the titles just aren't, you know, like, I'll give you an example, fall. So, I was looking at one that had like a fall subscription box, and it's really cute. It's adorable. It's got all these kind of cute fallsy themes to it. We don't have fall in Texas, y'all. We really just don't. I get about two days of it, and so it isn't like I have tons of leaf photos or us wearing cute sweaters. I mean, we kind of do in the winter time, but then it's winter, so I'm struggling with it. Now, I might just decide to buy stuff a la carte. We'll see. It's not as uh, effective, but price wise, but we'll see. So here's why I'm getting my little sticker here. And I decided I wanted to look all kind of wrinkly, you know, like you're kind of tossed down the film or whatever. And the fact that it's a self adhesive is perfect for this technique. I think it's cool. And frankly, I think it turned out cool as crap because I'm I, the pictures are irrelevant to me. They're not really, um, re, they're not related to my photo and not really just part of anything. So I don't care if I see the pictures. So I really think this looks cool. Uh, it, it looks like the film strip just kind of got tossed down there. It's all wrinkled up. I, I'm not going to lie. I really like it. And I still have quite a bit of that left. So I don't know what I'm going to do, though. They, it it kind of could act like a washi tape almost. I mean, it is a sticker. It could go like in a planner maybe or something. It could go as borders. I may do it as, ooh, I just had an idea. I may use it as uh, some strips on, on the back of a layout. I, I've got an idea now. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to reorganize these things, these paper block here after I got my little the funny thing is I had dry fit all those stars and all that stuff, and then I had to take it all off to do my sticker photo deal. <laughs> so I'm about to put them all back down. So who knows if they go back in the exact same place. I honestly couldn't tell you. So I'm just kind of using my ATG down here. Um, what else have I got going on? Oh, our internet went down in the middle of this too. My husband's like, hey, is the internet down? You know, blah, blah. So I'm going to put my paper back together here. I think this looks really cute. And I don't do a ton of journaling, by the way. I do put the date on it at the bottom. And uh, you'll see that. But, I mean, obviously, she's in a graduation outfit. <laughs> and you can see her college behind her. So, I know what it is. I don't really have to, you know, document that piece of it. I just put the date on it. Here's me going back through with my little acrylic stars. And I've got to figure out where they're going. Now, here's where my conundrum began. Um, I'm putting these stars down. And I go, well, they're just floating on top of this other star paper. And I didn't care for that. So, in just a minute, I'm actually going to get off into the... Uh, what do you call that? The viewfinder wheels. I showed you guys when I was kind of opening the kit up. And I'm going to actually use that in just a minute because I'll decide it's a really good cluster base. <laughs> so I'm going to take one viewfinder piece and I'll cut it in half and I'll put it on the bottom to hold those stars. See, I'm, I'm kind of looking there and I'm going, okay, yeah, this looks cute. I like this. So I'm going to pull it off and cut it in half. And then I'm going to pull up uh, the uh, that half. I'll use my little paper trimmer here. And I'll actually cut that half in half again and put the quarter piece in the upper left up there. So as I mentioned, this photo is, it's me, my husband, and my daughter at her college graduation. That building behind her is actually the little chapel that, that was on campus. This campus was really lovely. It was not, it's a D2 school, so it's not real large. It's not giant, um, but it's a, it was a really pretty school. And um, she did graduate in 2020, you guys. Uh, she went home for spring break that year and just, they told them never come back. <laughs> So her graduation ceremony was actually in August, I believe, and you guys, it was August in Oklahoma, so it was definitely warm. And the funny, I'll tell on my parent, my, my my mom, um, it was a it was a Saturday ceremony, obviously, and it it was three hours from our house, so we all drove up, my me and uh, my husband, and uh, of course my daughter, and then my bonus mom or my bonus dad and my mom, we all drove up there to stay the night, and. My mom and my stepdad had left their suitcase by their front door, so they didn't have any clothes. They were basically, he had on a pair of jeans and a shirt, and she had on um, whatever she had on. I think it was shorts or something, and they were like, oh, my God. I can't believe, they couldn't believe they left their suitcase, and I was like, Mama, it's going to be 97 degrees outside. There's going to be people in shorts because they were like, well, go get some clothes. You know, we'll go buy some clothes. Don't go buy no clothes. Don't do that. It's going to be 9,000 degrees out there. There is no reason. So they came casually dressed. And I said, you know what? That is perfectly fine. And it was. There were people in shorts. Um, so I have glued down my little viewfinder pieces. I've glued the other acrylic stars down. And now I'm gluing down my title. You do have to peel off, by the way, on the back of acrylics, the little film. Um, so if you've never used an acrylic, that little film, there's a little brown piece of paper usually on the back side that you peel off. And that's what I had to do just a second ago to get all that off. So I've got all my acrylics glued down. 
Now, here's a funny story I'm going to tell on myself. I pull out this little piece here, this little photo strip thing, and I think, oh, that's really cute. That's going to go there. And I leave it there. But guess what I didn't do? I didn't glue it down. I didn't glue it down. So I'm going to get distracted. Um, my son-in-law comes home, and we start chit-chatting about stuff. I'm, I'm going downstairs to check on this. It doesn't really matter. I had, was making some potatoes and stuff, so I ran downstairs. And I forgot to glue this down. So I'm going to show you the layout. Here's my layout. Isn't that really pretty, right? It's <laughs> slow down. Don't forget to, by the way, did you check out the playlist and all that kind of stuff? Because this is a scrap timber layout. So make sure you check out the playlist in the Facebook. But the funny part is I never glued that down. I went over, I took the photos and everything. So you can kind of see it here. I come back down here, do this voiceover and it's gone. I don't know where it is. So I stuck the other quarter piece of my viewfinder where that was. And so now what you're seeing, see, there's the picture. It's missing. I don't know where it is. So have a great day, you guys. We'll see you next time. Bye.